we're heading to um, farmer's market, which only happens uh, a couple of times a year. So we're really excited about that one. And it's middle of the city. And then we're going to go out to the forest and go picking berries. So we first shopping. We are picking berries. Yes. And we have a picnic. So we and we have berry pickers. So we're going to get a lingon or blueberries, or maybe both. We'll see. Whatever we find. OK, let's go. Picking blueberries. Just started. Liam just eats them. <laughs> He's put one single berry in the bucket. But it's a perfect day to be in the forest and picking blueberries. Yummy. Finding lingon too. This is what we did all the time when we lived here. Uh, James' parents came and I said, hey, you guys want blueberry pie? And they said, yes. And I said, then we had to go pick the blueberries. And I think that James' mom thought that was the most fun thing she ever done. Mm, she did have so much fun. Yeah, I had a hard time getting her to actually like stop, she's like, but there more blueberries. I was like, there are lots of them. But this is what you do in Sweden. You pick berries, mushrooms, nettles. A sign of blueberry picking, blue fingers. The hardest thing about when you're picking blueberries or berries, I have to show you these. It is to stop because there's lots more and you can hear the kids down there. It's like, I found a yak pot. And you had like, okay, it's time to go eat lunch. So we're gonna go down to the lake and go eat some lunch and take a little break and maybe come back. the sandwiches of the food lunch tastes better when you're out in the forest it does what did you eat i ate some blueberries let me see our face your mouth is so blue mm -hmm. is it good yeah Now comes the fun part. First of all, we're gonna separate the blueberries from the lingon because we only had one bucket with us. Oh, you got rid of the, all the blueberry around your face. Mm -hmm. All right, you're gonna help me with this job. Yep. So when we lived here, James, tell about what we used to do every night when the kids went to sleep. Oh, we would take turns going out into the, the forest. And one night it would be Frederica or it would be me. And we would just go out every night while it was key blueberry season. And we would just get liter after liter after liter. And we would freeze them. So we'd have blueberries usually till January, February, January, February exactly. Yeah, to make smoothies. And... I'm going to go free our little friend. Oh, you're such a nice vegan man. <laughs> There's some like a little bit of therapy in this too. Okay, here comes the fun part. The bar. <laughs> Put it in. 